hello beautiful welcome back again to my youtube channel how are you guys doing i hope you guys are doing great thank you all so much for clicking on this video i really appreciate every one of you please this is your first time coming across my youtube channel you're welcome my name is rose i'm a mommy lifestyle vlogger based in italy and on this channel we share a lot of videos that you like please don't make today your last ensure to subscribe and when you subscribe turn notification bell so that anytime i upload any video be the first person to be notified and to my tiny subscriber thank you all so much for coming back so guys i'm back again today with another video as you can see in this video we are in the bathroom um i'm brushing my kids mouth and after brushing their mouth i will bait them so i just want to show you guys a little bit of my morning routine what i normally do every day remember one of the, one of my previous video i said that europe is not easy like mothers we are really going through a lot especially those of us that don't even have family here we don't have any help hand here we are really going through a lot so this is i just want to show you guys how my morning routine always go like every morning this is what i do from monday to saturday sometimes my husband even work on saturday okay so and before I will, before we even wake up maybe he's about to um to go to work or he's already gone because my husband wake up by six something and because he leave the house by seven and he's starting work by eight so most time he's not there even even though maybe we wake up together he cannot even help me to carry baby because he too will be uh, preparing to go to work so this is how my morning routine always go after brushing their mouth now i will not they will not take their shower after beating them i will give them breakfast then we are what i will they will wear clothes and then we move okay so most times i don't even eat i don't take breakfast most times i don't even take my shower and guys do you know that sometimes eh, baby will, oh baby will be disturbing i will not take my shower till evening like when my husband is back from work that is when he can help me to carry this baby then i'll quickly take my shower because this boy i don't know once even though is sleeping or maybe i try to put him to sleep so that i can go and take my shower once i just enter inside the bathroom like this he will just wake up and i cannot just leave him there crying because i want to take my shower now so sometimes i don't even take my shower so even eat um eat breakfast because me i'm that kind of person that if i'm breastfeeding baby i can't eat or even that if i'm eating and baby is crying and then i give him uh, at the same time with breastfeeding i cannot breastfeed at the same time and i will be eating i don't know why i don't know if i'm the only one experiencing this thing so most times before i will even take breakfast in the morning it's around from 11 12 maybe when he's asleep like deep sleep i can quickly eat something so guys after beating them now i will go and give them breakfast and after breakfast they will put on their clothes and then I will just take them to school. It's not really easy. And if you are a mother in this Europe, you are see you are doing you are doing a very a very good job. Like, ha! I raise them for mothers for Europe. Like this place, eh, this place, like you are on your own. Nobody is nobody is coming to help you. <laughs> even though you have family here, like what I say in my previous video, even though you have family or you have friends here, they cannot come and help you because them to have their own their own things to do. This is Europe. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how to describe this place. This place is like how how will I even describe? I don't know how to describe it. Even those, even though your friend come to your house, that friend cannot cannot spend a whole one week in your house like helping you. <laughs> I don't know how to describe it, but so if if you are a mother, eh, you are in this Europe, like you have children, you are doing a great job. I salute you, ma. And for those of you that are in Africa that have opportunity, uh, family member, friends that always come around to help you out, you don't even know what God has done for you. So this is me, rubbing them now, after applying cream on their skin. I will put them, put um, wear them clothes, then keep. We'll, we'll go to the kitchen try to make breakfast for them after eating some many times i feed them because if i don't even feed them if i allow them to eat by themselves that day we are not going to school because these children if you give them something to eat if you give them food to eat <laughs> it will take them four hours they are still sitting on that on that place eating that food except me i feed them myself apart from that one they will just scatter the food everywhere. So me, I don't, I don't like, I don't want all those kind of stress. 
the one I'm facing is enough for me. So most times I feed them myself. So maybe if you see me one of in any of my video feeding my children, please don't say, oh, they are old enough to eat uh, to eat by themselves. The reason why I always feed them is this, because I don't like. Uh, if I allow them to eat by themselves now, before we even go to school, maybe they have already closed their school gate because they will sit on that place to eat that breakfast for more than three to four hours. So I always feed them. So after uh, rubbing, applying cream on their skin now, I will now take them to the kitchen to try and then give them something to eat. After eating, I'll, me, I will not change. Sometimes to even change just for me to put on my clothes. And this this baby would not even allow me. Like if I just put him down, like he will be crying. And the way today will be crying, he he will be crying as if they maybe somebody wiped him with cord or something had happened to him. So if I want to change now, I will just ask his sister to be um, playing with him, and then me I will just do fast fast and put on my clothes and then. I will just take them, take the kids to school. So this is how my morning routine always go. I hope you're you're liking this video. I hope you are enjoying this video. Please, if you are enjoying this video, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And if you are not yet subscribed to my YouTube channel, please help me and hit that subscribe button. It means a lot. Okay, please help me and subscribe. And don't also forget to turn notification bell so that. If I upload any video, it will be the first person to because when you subscribe, you don't you don't turn the notification bell. If I upload any video, you YouTube will not notify you. So that notification bell is very, very important. Please, when you subscribe, make sure to turn the notification bell so that if I upload any video, you will be the first person to be notified. I really appreciate everyone of you for watching video to this point. Thank you all so much for sticking around to this point. It's not easy. Oh. I really appreciate everyone of you. So guys, here we are. I'm trying to give them... Um, breakfast and these two girls sometimes i don't if i all ask them what do you want to take for breakfast this one will be saying one thing the other one will be saying another thing and at the end of the day if i just choose to give them one thing one person will not want to eat that thing so it's always stress 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 stephanie like she like biscuits and their fresh milk but success most times she requests for custard most times she requests for bread, and Stephanie, she's not a fan of bread, she's not a fan of custard, she's not, she's not even a fan of oatmeal. So, if I try to maybe force her to eat bread or eat another thing, she will not even want to eat it. So, most times it's just, and if I don't give them what they want in that morning, they will not be happy before they will go to school. Like, they will not, they, to rather they will not be happy. Sometimes they will just be angry to even, will even reach their school. Then me, I will try to pet them so that they will not go and report me to their teacher. <laughs> it's not easy, oh, this hero. <laughs> it's not easy at all. Ah, life here yeah, is just. Uh, although I'm not complaining because I'm I'm grateful where I am and I'm, I thank God for for where I am today. Like knowing fully where we am coming from. So it's not as if I'm complaining, but. This is, I'm just trying to tell you guys that this is how Europe life works. This is how Europe is. What is that? What is that? What is it? Look at me. What? It's there for the... What did she do? It's there for the of Avella. Go. Thank you. 